All right, just give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> Probably watch this out so I can start. That's okay. It hasn't started yet. You're still in the pre-show. Well, I thought that was never going to end, all those names. He's that guy. <laughs> okay. Should we start the show? Woo! Yeah! You guys want to see the show? Okay. Here we go. I'm going to start it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Identify That Song. The original game show that's not a ripoff of Name That Tune. They ripped it up from us. Now, please welcome the original host from 1970. Identify that song, my friend, Red Hosty Benson. Get out of here, Red. That's right. Thank you, darling. Get us some light out here. Come on out here, Red. Get a microphone for you right there. Hurry up. The song's not that long, man. Good guy. I'm tired. Oh, I am old, but I am here. Let's give it up for Gil Barron, everybody. Yeah. 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 I thought the credits came after a movie, Gil. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's right. He went on and on for days and days. Uh, Shelly, Shelly, Shelly. Give it to old Gil. He can take it. <laughs> Shelly, I'm telling you, I don't know. I don't know. Before every show, I look at myself in the mirror and I say, not again. <laughs> Not again. again. Just like I told you in 1974, this is the life we chose. We got to get out there and put on a show. That's it. That's the spice. There's no backing out now. That's what I need to hear before every show. Shelly giving me the fucking round of approval that I need that I never got from my parents. Huh? Oh, young man, how are you? Peachy King. Peachy King. Guys, this is my nephew. Please give it up for me. Ah. All right. Now. <laughs> All right. Who do I love? Me. Listen to that. Listen to him. Listen to him. I'm giving it up. My nephew. He's the chosen one. Huh? Love this kid. I love young Jewish Ooh, boys. Yeah. That's I love right. young Jewish boys. <laughs> <laughs> a little too much. A little too much. Little too much. Remember that time in '79? You got us in some hot water. I do remember that time. We got in trouble. <laughs> Let's not get into that right now. Let's get in to identify that song! Woo! All right. You guys want to see a show? Guys, what this show is, is it's just like Name That Two, except those rat bastards ripped us off. <laughs> we play songs, we have comedians identify them, and that's the fucking show. <laughs> that's how it goes, nice and easy. I right, what are we doing? What are we doing? We're going to bring up the first comedian. Let's bring out the guests. All right. Our first comedian, you know him from nowhere. <laughs> Nobody He's ever. also appeared in Not That Much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give it up for Michael Chap Resnick, everyone. Resnick, get out here. There he is. <laughs> take, a place, take a place at the table there, son. Come on out, my friend. I gotta stand for the show? Yeah, you gotta stand for the whole show. That being a kid afford my seats. <laughs> Look at us. We're combined 150 years old and we're gonna stand for this shit. This place is a dump. I love it here. I'm only kidding. We used to play for stadiums. But this is alright. This is okay. <laughs> <laughs> alright, next up! Good crowd work. All Good right, crowd. Thank you, you so much. It's lovely to see you. Hey, How are you, man? Hey, contestant, hit your button. Let's see what it sounds like. That's what it sounds That's like. That's Michael Shepard. How are you, man? Doing well. Good? Yeah. Very nice. I like it. Alright, that's what the crowd work. That's crowd work. That's the crowd work we all remember from the 70s. Goes. Check! Next person up, a <laughs> comedian. She's very lovely. I remember back in the day you used to be able to kiss contestants. You can't do that. No, we got in a lot of trouble in the end. a lot of trouble. I like to kiss, but we, I can't do it. We kiss so many contestants. Let's give it up. You wouldn't even know. <laughs> Next comedian, Jasper Sams. Come on, Woo! Go ahead. Right. Fist bump. That's it's not That's what they do these days. These it's kids say fist the same. bump. Seems aggressive to me. I'd it's rather aggressive. Have I don't care. I don't care. Next comedian coming out to the Hold stage. on a second. Hey, Jasper. Press the button. Let's see what it sounds like. That's your buzzer. Oh. It's very cute. We'll have another lovely time. Let's give it up for the next comedian, Jules Ford. Yay. Get out of here, Jules. Woo. Hello, Jules. Have a, 
kind of stand next to the table. Jules, how you doing? Good, good. How good are you? Uh, pretty good. You feel like you're gonna be good at this game? I'm gonna win. <coughs> oh shit, that's what we like. The cojones on this character! A little bit of undeserved confidence. A little bit! A little bit! I kinda wanna hit him. <laughs> but I'm not going to! I wish you luck, sir. Please, hit your buzzer. Let's see how it sounds. That's your buzzer. Hello? Do it again. Sweet. You got the boy on. I just want to hear. Oh, what's yours? Everybody, press the buzzer. Get it out of your system. Let's get it over with. All right, that's what they saw. Music to my ears. Oh, so much time. So much time. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Yo, you're doing all right, Red. We're doing okay. Yeah, you're doing all right. How's the crowd doing? Give me a round of applause, crowd. Crowd applause every now and then. Only reason why I get up out of bed in the morning. <laughs> the doctor says I have to have a little less cocaine <laughs> and a little more fruit juice. Jelly! But he only down. But I can have as much crowd applause as I want. I've never heard so much cocaine. <laughs> I used the old kind of cocaine. Cocaine had in has the a 60s. negative effect on us. It's called slow coke. Yeah, slow coke. <laughs> it's like diet coke. We went to her. Way more slow. I went with a slow. Slow. Comedian. Slow comedian. Comedian. That's, that's what happens. Comedians, oh. that's what they do. They put one word into the other word. And now it's a joke. Who brought a comedian out of this show? Come on. No. Let's give it up for your last contestant. Oh, well, that was for him. Nobody <laughs> likes it. I got, the sound, I got all the sound effects, I'm gonna use every single one of them. Your drop speed is his best. <laughs> That's yeah, right. That, that new rap stuff. This, new, this next comedian owes me $12. Tonight, I plan to collect. Let's give it up for Brian Newsom, everybody. Yay! I'm gonna stand. What is this? Who gave this man a chair? Clever comedians. Slow K. Slow K. Slow K. Chip. The look on this kid. I like this kid. You got a real World, world War II haircut. Not our side. No. The other side. <laughs> I don't have a side. Good response. Bad response. We don't like it at all. Comment. Oh, yeah. You feeling good? You want to go okay? No. I do. Do you got any go okay? you, you have any go okay? I do. How about me? For Jasper, let's see if the scoreboard even works. I'm gonna put a point up for Jasper for giving us cocaine later. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see how it works. There's, there's one point. That's what it is. There's a point. You gotta use your eyes, people. Barbara. <laughs> Anybody here? Hey, it's the only thing that uh, Google Sheets lets you do. You know what? The right page is 74, which is what I am now. I'm feeling a little. I'm feeling a little for club. Yeah, well, you, don't look, show. you don't look a day over 73 and a half. Shelly Green, everybody. Woo. Pulling me out of the gutter. Bringing me back up. I'm feeling it. The show's back on. Here we go. Uh, Let's stop this goddamn thing. That was, my, that was me. Do we hear Brian Musil's buzzer? That's what it sounds like. How you doing, man? You're great. I love you. I love you. Everybody. This next game, the first, the first game. Hold on. <laughs> Let's tell them what they're going to win. Oh, What's at stake? You for this show. You and I could be talking to any one of you. The winner will go home with 100. No. That's it, okay. No. <laughs> with 50. No. It's one dollar. With three. Run. We have to pay for it out of our own pocket. One dollar. One dollar. One American dollar. Plus, Plus whatever you wish. You can hold it up. <laughs> Plus this version of the whole thing. Put it into a pile of items. This is the version of the home game the winner will receive. It's a CD I made that's got all the clips from the show on it. You can play by yourself, identify that song at home. And if you call us up and you have enough drugs, maybe we'll come over. We will definitely come over to your house. <laughs> Let's start the game! <laughs> all right, let's start the show. The first game is called Eat It or Beat It. We will play a Weed Out parody song or the original song that was paradise. Buzz in as soon as you know which one it is, 
and then identify that song. All right, y'all ready? Whoever buzzes in first, tell us if it's the parody or the original. This is the parody. It's Amish Paradise. That is Amish Paradise. That is correct. Yeah. Well done, Two points, Two points. Two points. Oh, there it goes. So tired. <laughs> Just get through this, man. We'll, we'll, we'll go to Musso and Fink's and we'll have a good uh, stay. Are we going to go to Musso's after this? We're going to go to Musso's and have a stay. Right. Colin, Bobby, you want to go to Musso's? Yes. Buy me a steak. Okay. Done. I love it. I love it. All right. Let's give it up to Colin one more time. Yeah. <laughs> that's the song. Okay. That's the song. That's the song. Now, do, do I introduce the next one, or do I do I say what? The next one? Uh, yeah, say what it is. What is it? I next? forgot how my show works. In 2006, we now released a parody of a 2004 Green Day song. Which one is this? Now hold on a second. You buzzed in before you even heard the song. Stupid bastard! What is it? Is it the original or the parody? I'm not giving you any more. Yeah. It's the original. And it's American Idiot. That is correct. Yeah. That is the original. It was earned. He came in fast, but it was earned. We'll give him two points for that, even though a little faster than the buzzer. So watch yourself. We're going to take a break for a second and talk about one of our sponsors. Shelly. We got sponsors. We got sponsors. Shelly, you need a website? Yeah. <laughs> Shelly, you ever try Squarespace? <laughs> no. Apparently, Squarespace helps you with a website. What do they do? They make a website for you. They come in and take your picture and they put it out on the internet? I don't know. Squarespace.com. <laughs> Get Squarespace. <laughs> What's your offer code? Offer code. Hashtag. <laughs> you figure out how to spell it. <laughs> My sponsor is WordPress. What is this shit? It is. You guys forgot about WordPress, man? That's a better site. WordPress? What you kill it. What's you the do a great job, right? Being serious. How do you find a WordPress on the uh, internet? If you go with that. You're looking for WordPress, where do you go? Colin I'm asking you, it's your sponsor. Oh, okay, WordPress. Oh, We're doing jokes on top of jokes. Hang on, let's get back to the goddamn show. Let's play the game. Can you get how it works? Shelly! Okay. In 2003, we now released a parody of the 1973 Billy Joel classic. Is this the Billy Joel song? Which one is it, Brian? It's the parody. That's correct. What's it called? Hey, the kids got it. The kids uh, got it. Hold on now. Oh, the Spider Man? Let's check with our judges. The correct answer is O to a superhero, parentheses, Spider Man. We'll take it to a We'll take it. He got it. it. Yeah. All right. Maybe this game was too easy because they could just guess. <laughs> we'll put it, we'll, tell, we'll talk to our writers later. You guys are playing for a lot of bread tonight. A lot of bread. Speaking of bread, you know what I love? Olive loaf. <laughs> Not the bread, the sexual move. <laughs> we made it back in the 1960s. It's when you make love to a fat person, you expel flavors in the order that falls, and then you smell it after you have sex with them. <laughs> oh, we did it all the time back in the day. It's don't also get weird. don't get weird about it, people. The name for having sex with lunch meat. Either way, Colin, you like olive oil? <clears throat> Both kinds. <laughs> the food. <laughs> <laughs> so, Say that just now. I think you gave my point. Yeah. Give them a point. They get a point. Hey. Uh, you hey, Charlie, it up. Are up in the booth, uh, are you able to scroll down just a hair so we can see the names on the bottom, maybe? Let's see if, let's see if we can see that. Just maybe use the mouse to, to scroll it up a little bit. Hi. Oh, well, there we go. Oh, it's going all over the place. Oh, all right, this is fun. Here we go, there it is. Hey! Jasper's in the lead, Jules, and then Brian. You got it now? It didn't uh, update yet, but you got two points. All right, yeah, just down. take you my word for it. You used to play Coliseums. There it goes. Brian Mason with two points. Now we're here. All right. In 1988, we now released a parody of a 1987 Michael Jackson song. Now you want to take a guess? You got to listen to the song, people. This is out of control. What are you, you going to guess? I'm going to say the parody. 
and beat it. I mean, eat it. That's wrong and wrong. Wrong and wrong. Why are you? Wrong? I told you it's the original you already. Don't get me for that. What's it called, kid? What's it called? Eat it. No. Wrong. I got that. Yeah. Beat it. No. Wrong. Jazz will no points. Audience, do you want to steal? Oh, let's get it. Let's 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 get it. Let's get it. Oh, let, me, let me come down here and talk to people. How are you, sir? I'm Ducky. You Ducky? What's your name? Greg. How you doing? I'm Ducky. You're Greg. Thanks. What's the song? Uh, I'm bad or bad. That's right. It's called bad. Yeah. You're gonna win the whole thing. You're gonna win one whole dollar. The audience is on the board with one point. Colin, where are you on? No that was embarrassing. Y'all got that wrong. Oh my god. Okay, let's go to the next game of this show. You suck. Ah, that's, oh, that, that's just a... That was for you, Colin. That's just a mean one, all right. You still my favorite nephew. What's the next, what's the next game? I'm so with Frank's Woo! The next game is called Complete That Lyric. You get to listen. Yeah. You get to listen. Listen. This is when you have to listen to the end, all right? You get to listen to the following clip in its entirety. And then buzz in to finish the next one. You understand? Do you get it? Yeah. Here we go. I'm the mother of the pepper around my tools. My beats are fat and the buds are on my back and I'm on it. I'm on it. You tend to proceed, you will be conceived. Cause I hit you with my brother while I was there. I'm not just wild, I'm trained to best I was raised by a rapper and by a potato that subsequently procreated. <laughs> 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 Okay, what's the next lyric? Rhinoceros? Who's that? That's, there's more to it than that. Come on. Yeah. The hip hop eponymous, the rhinoceros. Very close. Very close. Very close. Very close. Hip hop eponymous, my rhymes are bottomless. <laughs> or, uh, close enough. I think close that's pretty enough. good. Close enough. Jules Ward gets it. It's, it's um, the hip hop eponymous. My lyrics are bottomless. It's funny because he doesn't say anything after it. Okay. That's the joke. Are we ready for the next one? Is there a clue for this or are we just going? I don't remember. No, no, no. Um, should, should I say what it is so far? Yeah, okay, I'll do it. Finish the lyric from this Adam Sandler song which they viewed on Saturday Night Live in 1996. Hold on, I was giving Jules a point. When do we buzz? Listen. You buzz after you listen to the thing. <laughs> Did you say? Give it to us. Is this the one you just said? No, right. It's not. Wait. What did you say? <laughs> Get on the same page as me, Randy. Hold on. This is why they kicked us out of CBS. I had a lot to drink today. <laughs> you had a lot to drink always, Red. That's what makes Red hosty. <laughs> <laughs> Finish the lyric from his classic. Don't always have to fuck her hard. In fact, sometimes that's not right to do. Sometimes you got to make some love and fucking give her some smooches too. Jules! Sometimes you got to say please. No. Wrong! Anybody else? You were very close. It's close, but no. I'll give you this. It was the second one. Oh, two lines were looking for. You gotta think before you talk. Everybody? Oh, I didn't see this! Jules? Whoever made the sound guy? Who was it? Audience! You? Sometimes you got to squeeze. Keep going, Sometimes that's right. Sometimes you got to say please. That's right. What else? Sometimes you got to say hey. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck you. Sometimes you. <laughs> There we go. That's exactly correct for the audience. Audience is killing it tonight. We might be better coming with Alex. We might be better coming with Alex over here. You guys suck. <laughs> Why did we pick you? <laughs> Next time. We'll be... You guys, the only ones who said you would do it. That's right. We're donating a dollar to the prize. Oh, my God. A two dollar prize. All right. It's up to two dollars. And this CD. Guys, this kitty. This kitty is huge. It's a big fucking cat. 
If Musil wins, I'll only owe you ten now. If Musil wins, I'll kill myself. <laughs> I'm going back because I'm going to get no points. I feel bad. You have negative three. It's insane. I'm rich. <laughs> Well, you, you can't buy the kind of glory that you get winning this game on the Pack Theater stage. Let's give it up for Gil Barry once more for putting on Pack Show. Yeah. All right. Yeah. And let's give it up for this one the audience. Woo! Just a little crowd. All right, they keep it up. All right, let's go. We got to do. Uh, give it up for one more of our sponsors. <laughs> Shelly, you got dogs. <laughs> never, never particularly liked animals of any sort. You, you got a dog. I do. And you got to walk them to get her work. I do. <laughs> what are you gonna do? I call uh, Squarespace. <laughs> Squarespace.com. Nothing gets by Shelly. They Shelley. come over, they take a picture of you, they put you on the internet, they walk you up. Nothing gets by Shelly. <laughs> What's next? It is this lyric from the Adam Sandler song, which they viewed on Saturday Live in 1996, like I said before. <laughs> That's incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I feel like he didn't notice something. <laughs> It's not a rhyming. Like it the it's dog. not a rhyming lyric. I'll give you that much of a hint. Anyone in the audience? Audience, what do you got? <laughs> Let's move on. Never have sex with you. I will never have sex with you. I will never have sex with you. All right, that's enough of that game. All right, enough of that game. You guys did great, though. Seriously. Woo! Give yourselves a round of applause. called Sitcom Beth. Identify the sitcom and the artist who wrote or performed the following theme songs. You don't have to listen to the end, okay? Just buzz in when you know it. Good. Yes, no. What is it, Jess? They might be giants, you're not the boss of me. That's correct. What's the name oh, of the show? On what show? Malcolm in the Middle. That's good. Yeah, everybody! For two points. <laughs> You're in the lead. Look at that. Look at how tall that bar is. If this was the '70s, we would be kissing. <laughs> I don't know. It's in the, you got trouble. In, you got in trouble in the '70s. Oh yeah. You're, you're, that's the past is behind me, my friend. I'm looking forward to the future. <laughs> the number of times we had to run from the police after the show. Oh, Can't even remember. These if I was winning more than a dollar, I would let you. Oh. How much is the kitty right now? What do we got? Oh. Hey, well, we can take a look. No, I need like a car and a trip. It's a CD run. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give you a trip to Musso and Frank's, where you can have the steak and cocaine plan. Are people hanging out? <laughs> <laughs> That's a show. This NBC sitcom ran from 1990 to 1996. Name the show and the artist who performed the fucking. <laughs> Who was that? Uh, Will Smith, Jones. Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Uh, that's Who not wrote? the correct name of the the artist. Who's the artist? Uh, Fresh Prince or DJ Jazzy Jeff? Turn it around. DJ Jazzy Jeff and Fresh Prince. That's correct. There you go. These kids, they don't remember the Fresh Jones Prince water, was man. just the MC. The main act was DJ Jazzy Jeff. That's what we went to see back then. The top bill. That's right. And he aired it. What is that? Two points for Jules? Okay. Woo. We'll give him two. We get to talk about one of our sponsors again. What? Who's on Franks? They make a hell of a mistake. Come check us out sometime. Oh, we're selling Franks. That was that was their cocaine. That's not their This CBC kid sitcom started. CBC, what the hell was that? What? Maybe Rock? Are you having a stroke, Red? It said CBC on there. Did I write CBC on there? You fucking did. Well, maybe I was having a stroke earlier. Let's just play it. Our whole universe was in a hot, dense state that nearly 40 million years ago. Resnick! Oh, shit. Um. <laughs> wait, is this not. Uh, Go expansion like, started. Is the Big Bang Theory or the Mike Way Off? Big Bang Theory! Big Bang Theory's the end of the show! Who's the artist? I thought it was the Mighty Giants again. Is you are wrong! That's incorrect. Jules. Bare Nakedly. Hey! That's correct. We don't care what they All right. Keep it down, Jules. Good job, President. Uh, you You're tied with a musical. You don't need to be. Just one behind the audience. Kill it. <laughs> you do a great job. Yeah. I'm so tired. <laughs> this NBC sitcom <laughs> ran from 1985 to 1990. Name the show and the singer of the theme. the colored shows like we used to. We used to watch the colored shows. <laughs> Resting. Was your show called No Place Like Home? No. It's so wrong. It's so wrong. <laughs> so white and so wrong. Can never be more wrong? Is it Nell? No. No. It's not Nell. Anybody? 
Mike. Anybody else? Mike. Oh, I will come. I will come. He's going to guess. I'm going to say room 227. Oh. Room 227. Oh, no. <laughs> what? Who was that in the back? Somebody knows what it is. You were very close. Very close. No, I was looking at room 227. <laughs> I feel like you know what it is, sir. Is it? Do you know? It's 227. It's oh! just 227. Who sang it? No clue. No clue? Jack A. Very close. She was in the show. Uh, Marla Gibbs. Marla Gibbs. Marla Gibbs, everybody. Oh, Marla Gibbs. We'll give the audience a point for that. Woo! You get the point. Marla Gibbs and I had a little thing back in the 80s. <laughs> well, that's not the way she told it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that ruins my next line. <laughs> Sorry. Damn it, Shelly! <laughs> we got this from Paul. Me and him, we go way back. Yeah, we go way back. You said some other. Sometimes a little too far. I ruined them. <laughs> <laughs> there are days, and there are days. Back to the show! <laughs> the NBC sitcom that ran from 1978 to 1986 named the show and the writer of the theme. And this one, Mike, you're a little crazy, don't you? Now the world is. For one point, what's the name of the show? Different Strokes. That's correct. Good. Do you know who wrote this theme song? No idea. This is a hard one, actually. Anyone? The audience, the audience raised its hand. We wrote a lot of theme songs, we wrote Alan Thicke. Oh, he's right! That is correct! Oh, wow. Alan Thicke himself. Our old friend. Collins on the board! Woo! Well, yes, there you go. Uh, did you dress yourself today? Yeah, you look very nice. Yeah. I'm proud of you. That's a very nice dress. Why are you dressed for? She got points. Oh, oh, Ooh, Jasper, Jasper got points. Got How points. did that happen? <laughs> Apparently, somebody wants Jasper to win. We want you to come to Moose and Frank's with us and change your opinion about how much you'll make out for. Oh. Anyways. All right. Are you happy now, Jules? I fixed it. This <laughs> next game is called Island Visit. Identify the guest artist on each of these songs by the group The Lonely Island. Are you ready? Whenever you whenever you're ready, buzz it. This Lonely Island song originally aired in 2006. Name the guest Rob. I don't see mother. That's uh Jess. That's correct. That's correct. She had it. Are we all surprised? She's doing great. The rest of you. Is that the part of the show? Jasper and the audience are doing lovely. Jasper and Jules are in the lead, and the audience are close second. <laughs> hey, Michael Chap, Leslie, where were you? You guys need some slow cocaine? Where were you just now? Where was I just now? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Squarespace.com! The walk your dog. They'll come, they'll take out your garbage, they do everything. They'll put a day in, whatever. This 19, this Lonely Island song, originally aired in 2011, name the guest singer. Who, I didn't see who I got. Who is that? Who was? Who was first? Be honest. Let's give it to you. Only three? Only count of three? Well, do you know what? Go ahead. Justin Timberlake? Is that right? That's right! That's right! Justin Timberlake. The song is called Mother Lover. Musical's on the board. How you guys enjoying the show so far? Yeah. And we admit, we are both on a lot of drugs right now. <laughs> Old people need drugs to live. That's right. Oh no. My doctor said. What doctor did do? More brews and more meth. Uh, oh. Keeps your system running. That's very true. This Lonely Island song debuted in 2011. Name the guest singer. Was Michael Bolton! That is correct! Look at the audience doesn't even want to clap anymore because it's not even fair! It's not even fair! There we go.
It's about pirates. It's a song about pirates. About pirates, about movies, about friendship. That's what the show is. <laughs> Jasper's in the lead, ladies and gentlemen. Jewel's a close second. Michael can't press it nowhere. <laughs> Play like the one song. I went to research some songs and you guys were like, watch some songs. I just listened to Steve Martin's King Tut like 10 times in a row. <laughs> If you want to register a complaint, Gil Barron is the man. Gil Barron is the man. Talk to him. Punch him in the face if you need to. Punch him in the face. It feels real good. Next song, what? the Lonely Island song, first aired in 2009. Name the guest. Jules. T Pain. That is correct. Oh, Jules for T Pain is on a boat. On a motherfucking boat. I'm done with this game. Not the whole game show, this part of the game. <laughs> Next I game! I gonna walk out like that time in 82. I will leave! For no reason scared. whatsoever. Oh, I'm sticking around. Here we go. Next game is called Film Icon. Name the movie based on the following iconic music scenes. Wait a second, Shelly. All right, I'm ready. I'm Which 1988 film featured this well-known Harry Belafonte song? I yeah, Jess. That's correct. Uh -huh. Some of us are winning. Hey. One guy clapped. Where were you guys on that? <laughs> How does she have so much time to watch movies? <laughs> she's obviously single. <laughs> what? I opened the make out and she said, no, I'm a very attractive man. <laughs> He's still going to win to me, though. And that makes a signal. I was just following your logic. <laughs> because she won't make out. That does make sense! This, dude, this guy's playing for me, this, this one question. I love it. My nephew, come. This is going to be the only one resting, though. I've always loved you. You're one of my favorites. You're named after my favorite butler. Oh. He's not butler? Benson. Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, he's giving you a picture. What the it's hell? It's on the poster. His name's Red Benson. It's. Hosting, hosting, man. Hosting. Which 2004 film featured this version of a Starland vocal band song? What was that? Anger Man. Gonna find my baby, gonna hold her tight, gonna grab some afternoon delight. Resnick gets a point. Resnick gets a point. Yeah. Back from the dead. Back from the dead. He's walking. He's looking at the brains. <laughs> it's almost over, folks. Don't it's worry. A oh, I love Pat Schiller. Oh, look at this. I'm getting all kinds of texts. We gotta get out of here. Get to Blue Sword Fridge. Okay, okay, okay. Everybody. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Name the 2004 film featuring this Queen song. Oh shit. Where is it? You don't have a Resident, you hit it. Jules? Shaun of the Dead. That's Shaun of the Dead, that's right. Two more. Back to the board. All right, it's close. Ryan Yusuf, what do we got here? Yeah. How are you doing? Am I here? <laughs> I feel like I haven't heard from you in quite some Where are you at? Oh, I'm the... What happened? <laughs> Maybe you should have stood. No problem, people. Let's keep the show going. We're almost there. We're almost up to the next show. Identify this 1996 film featuring the karaoke rendition of this Jefferson Airplane classic. Cable guy. Whoa! Hey, hey. When the truth is found. That is correct.
We're going to take the top two, so please give it up for your losers tonight. Michael Chap Resnick and Brian Pistol. Get him out! The valiant effort. You, you can leave now. I love you. Get out of here. You didn't win. Better luck next time. Sorry. I gotta do something. <laughs> all right. All right. Sounds good. See Give you. Give it up for the boys. Everybody. Yay! They won. Not that good. Two buzzers each. All, all right. right. It's the final game. It's called bid a note. These top two, these two, these top two contestants right. face off. I'm cracking up, sorry. These two top contestants face off. Bid on the number of seconds you will need to identify the final song. You don't have to buzz in for this. I know you want to. Oh. Um, uh, hold on. We're going to play a song. Oh. Now we're going to give you a hint first. You're going to give them a hint. Okay, I'm going to play the song. Sorry, sorry. We've been doing this for 40 years. Ugh, everything smells like cocaine. <laughs> this song with a funny name debuted in a biographical musical from 1993. The name of the song first appears at 21 seconds. So we're going to start the bidding at 21 seconds. It's from a musical. Jasper, bid 21 or less seconds. Uh, 10. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. That's impressive. Jules, are you going to underbid that? Do I hit 9? I'll go with 7. Seven Ooh. seconds. Seven. All right, Jess, you wanna you wanna go into seven or tell him to do it? Uh, you, you can do it. It's fine. Okay. okay. So what happens if neither of us get it within the time that we've chosen? You don't. Well, we have a time. <laughs> if you don't win, she wins. Oh. What, what year was the musical from again? Ninety three. Nineteen ninety three. A good year. <laughs> okay. For some. <laughs> Everyone, shut the fuck up. This is for jewels and jewels only. You can steal if he doesn't know it. Hold on, here we go, seven here seconds. Here we go with the show. Seven seconds. The Scott. <laughs> That's seven seconds. Song from a musical, 1990. I feel like people out there know what it is. Jules Ford, what is it? Oh. We only have eight minutes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I don't know. Uh, jazz singer. The what? Incorrect. Are you saying, wait, 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 what did you say? It's not a completely wrong answer. What did you say? The jazz singer. Yeah. Lead the stage. <laughs> <laughs> don't clap. <laughs> wait till he goes. Now clap. Jasper, you know what it is? Jasper, yeah. Um, you already won, so. <laughs> oh. Now do you know what it is? Is it the mystery of Evan Drew? No, what it is? You should have said it. Eight you should have said it, Jules. No, I Audience. I don't know. That's the musical. What's, What's the, the song, song called? Shmanoinkle. Uh, Who said it? Who said it? That is correct. Like, hey, wait, say it into the mic. Like a nice person. The audience <laughs> has won. We're going to The audience has won the whole it's thing. Amazing. I said it was the most big I love oh, it. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's your name, sweetheart? What's your name? None of your business. She's got an attitude on her. I like that. Sweetheart, you just won. You just won. No, she gets the money. She gets, she gets the money. We split it up. No, 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 no. you get the money. You so like to go to Musso and French? Give 10 cents to each person here. You can get the cocaine at Musso and French. Yes, you absolutely can. What? You can What was the name of the musical? There were so many people talking, I didn't hear it. I can chat with you. What are you doing here? Well, what was the name of the musical? What about? Cannibal the Musical. Cannibal the Musical. Thank you, cool. Oh, thank God. Featured here at uh, one of the movie nights. Okay. That's the show. Give it up for Jasper Sanders. That's the show! Give it up to all your contestants. Give it up for yourselves. Give it up for yourselves. You were fantastic. You were okay. Everybody, I'd like to take one minute, one minute to really say, Squarespace.com. <laughs> 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 They'll take out your garbage. They'll make you dinner.
they send you a box and it's got everything you need to make dinner in. Exactly! It's one box! <laughs> 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 what are you, what are you here wasting your time for? 